Ladies and gentlemen, Nancy Norton! Sounds like I'm doing a TED Talk for Easy Bank. <laughs> but I'm from the Ozarks, I do Jed Talks. <laughs> Uncle Jed! <laughs> Woo, doggies, we're gonna make a cake. We got a big cake, we got too much cake, we gotta force it out with our other cake pan. You got your primary, you got your secondary, and then your secondary becomes your... Primary. I like, I like you guys. <laughs> primary, secondary, primary, secondary, cake, 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 setting you up for the type 2 diabetes that you now have. The hardest thing was that the oven would get sort of dirty in there. Like the chocolate would get to hang off the light bulb. Stalactites of chocolate were hanging off. They didn't give any easy off for the easy bake. That would have been good product pairing. Easy off, easy bake. No, you had to send Barbie in spelunking. <laughs> Get in there, Barbie. No, I'm afraid. Get in there, Barbie. Get in there, Barbie. No! You couldn't get her in the little slot either because in the 60s, certain Barbie parts were disproportionately large. <laughs> I'm not gonna go into detail. They're in the clean shop. You had to shave those off, and that's... <laughs> that was wrong. <laughs> According to my mother. <laughs> and it took a lot of time. <laughs> I don't care how rough your sidewalk is. Barbie in there to go spelunking. <laughs> stalactites of chocolate. I don't know why I like saying stalactites of chocolate. I think because I feel good about the fact that I know stalactites go down. Everybody know that? Yeah. That's right. We remember it because we have little rhymes from sixth grade that are locked in your mind. I had, and this is a true story. This is, I'm not even making this up at all. Mrs. Connard in sixth grade in the Ozarks. Kids, if you're having trouble remembering the difference between stalactites and stalagmites, Think about this. If the mites crawl up your legs, <laughs> up your legs, that's right, you have to take your tights down to scratch them. <laughs> that is creepy learning. <laughs> but you will not forget that. <laughs> you will try like I did. I've tried to forget it, but I cannot forget that. It is locked in. <laughs> Can you guys tell from there uh, I'm a super dork? Is it obvious? Uh, yeah. I'll never be cool. Sorry. We were not a cool... Our whole family is pretty dorky. We're a big family. All dorks. We raised by a wild pack of wiener dogs. <laughs> wiener, are you a wiener dog person? We shout out. Yes. I know. You love them. We had wiener dogs. We don't like them called wiener dogs. Just so you know, if you see us out walking our dog, don't just yell out wiener dog. Because you never, no one will let you just walk that dog, will they? You can't just walk, a, you can't not walk that dog. Look at the wiener, honey. Look at the hot dog sausage. Wiener, hot dog sausage. This is not a wiener. <laughs> Even the dog is kind of ticked off. Arr, arr, ich bin ein Dog, soon imbecile. <laughs> Tell him, Phallus. <laughs> too far, too far. I did not know what that meant either. <laughs> my parents thought that was hilarious. It was my job to jog the dachshund. I had to job it. I had to jog it. I had to jog the dachshund. That was my job. And have you ever, did you ever take your dog jogging? You know, they have legs this long, right? In the front, in the back, a little bit longer. Don't want, I don't know why God made them like that. They get up any speed at all, their bottom actually starts getting in front of them. <laughs> True story. It's like a race. Front end, hind end, front end, hind end, front end, hind end. Sideways, street sweeping wiener dog. Coming right at you. Pretty soon it's just wiener dog bottom and you're... Ah! Not a great attack animal. Sick them! Who's that gonna scare, you know? <laughs> They're gonna run anybody off your property? Go get them! Not gonna scare anybody. Maybe that one guy coming out of the manhole for lunch. <laughs> Woo! Next week he's in therapy. <laughs> Doctor, it was 
It was like a cyclops unicorn with a double chin. Come on out. Was that too graphic? I'm trying to find the line here. Let's say it's neuter and it's just a cyclops. A unicorn. How about a cyclops with a, a lazy eye? Would that be funny? Is that funny to anybody? I have, a, I, ha I have a lazy eye. Actually, I call it my easy bake eye. I got a bad case of easy bake eye. Don't feel bad. I get to park my sound. Just, I'm there. Get out. <laughs> Tell me if you think this would be funny. If I prayed to God to fix my lazy eye and God said, I don't know, are you talking to me or? <laughs> Is that a keeper? Oh, my God, I have to pray like this. <laughs> uh, if, if you have a lazy eye, you know it's, it is. People actually will move over when I'm talking to them. <laughs> but it does make you kind of funny. So that's the silver lining. Actually, I say every cloud has a silly lining. I'm writing a book about like kind of tragic, funny stories just to demonstrate that. I go around talking about humor and why we actually need it. It's a, I don't know if a lot of people know this. It's a basic human need. Um, I actually have a history as a registered nurse. And thank you, one person. Uh, no, you don't have to clap for that. But yes, are you a nurse also? With a wiener dog. What, what are the odds? <laughs> what are the odds? We are maybe, you know, what, what did we get dis... Connected at birth or something? I mean, you, do, you, do you have a lazy eye? Um, well, yeah, I can tell. You're looking right at me. I'm actually talking to you and that guy in the hat. He's like, I'm not a nurse. Why is she saying this? My eye goes out and up slightly. Kind of like it makes the move like a chess, you know, piece. Like night, the night goes up, over, you know, over one. Anyway, over two, whatever. Over, up one, over two, up two, over one. Doesn't matter. But that's basically, okay, so you are a nurse, too. Um, I, thank you for doing the job that I could not do. I actually got out of nursing for the same reason a lot of people get into it, to save lives. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not a great nurse. Um, I didn't want to really be a nurse. My mom tricked me. That's another story. So that's how that works. Is your mom a nurse? No, because no, that happens. Is your dad an alcoholic? I... Uh, <laughs> Laugh every day. Thanks so much. I'm Nancy Norton, and have a great night.